there's been a lot of talk about airline routes to do with the flat earth. And as we've established, this Sydney to San Diego flight, it just has no uh, footage. No one has stepped forward to prove the flight. And in fact, there's been fraudulent attempts. So that really looks bad for that flight, in fact. Well, this map here is very, very interesting indeed. It is the main suggested yachting routes to, uh, you know, cover the earth. And you'll see glaringly that nobody is going from Australia to South America straight up. They're all coming in an arc. As you can see, they would go up this way. You can see the flow patterns of it all. Look at the big V here and the big V here and the big empty space here. Now, there are other maps that suggest boats do go across here but i'd suggest there's a bit of fraud in uh, some of these maps could be the story there because look at the way this one is and this is for yachts now in the big commercial shipping of course that's controlled by big business this is sort of probably for uh, safety for yacht people type map based on those ideas so they're really not going to tell people to go in these areas because you couldn't because it's this isn't the way the map is of course i'll show you some of the other images everything seems to have a little bit of this idea mostly happening and there's just the odd little uh little bit you know working against that but as i said that could be frauded because this here being a yachty one i tend to think this is the correct one because this is for the average, you know, yachtsman or catamaran owner. This is where this would be taken from. And there's no going straight across here. So it's just not like that. Now this one here from the textbook of maritime medicine. And again, we've got the big bell out here. And the big bell here. This one reckons you go from uh, Rio across to here. Well, that is a famous route, isn't it? That the uh, people coming to Australia used to go to Rio and then across. Because I guess with the relationship with South America and Africa, in fact, the whole Atlantic is only a narrower body of water. So you may be able to go across to this one. It's this side is much more important in the equation and the centre one. And both of them are lacking on this map. So there's a few maps that say there's... Uh, one, this one's suggesting, oh, uh, look, air freight or something. Anyway, this is air freight or something. See, now that blue line there, I don't agree that exists. So again, big holes in these things here. You know, these little faint lines they've just drawn in. That might just be uh, to keep people uh, off the trail as it were it certainly needs some real investigation that is for sure at a high level i will do some more digging on this but i think that's a really good one let's look more into shipping in the world yeah look at this thing here suggesting some uh, thing across to here. It just doesn't fit with all those others, especially that yachting one. That to me is one I'd trust the most out of all of these. And it's the one that clearly shows there's no uh, connecting that way. See, look at this one here, it's a bit telling. So they're coming down into here, aren't they now? There's nothing across here. This is a global commercial shipping route. Uh, definitely weak on those ideas. There's the odd bodge here. Look, it's sort of saying it goes here. It probably goes much further there. A much bigger bell than they're putting on. There's another one here just for... See, it still bells right up. 
Namibia's just going. Wouldn't it be just so easy just to go from Perth straight over to South Africa? I bet you they go all the way up to the Maldives and across, because that would be the uh, way you'd go. Again, cruise ships could be another thing that would be a, a big clue on this. So I'll type in cruise ship routes. Well, there's not very good maps for cruise ships, but here's a repositioning cruise for the fall. And there is no activity, as you can see, anywhere in the south. And then there's a, another one of these cruise repositioning for the spring, it says. Where is that now? Here, look, spring repositioning. And again, we lack any activity across here. So I think those other commercial uh, routes were fabricated. Yes, yeah, looks like folks that uh, this is very good evidence, I think, in the end of the day, when people look at this really well. See, here we go again. Look at this. Everybody's going up through and around like this. Nobody's travelling straight across. No cruise to South Africa. Yes, yeah, so I guess cruise ships uh, do only have smaller areas. They patrol around, but you think it'd be some sort of activity in cruises, wouldn't you, in the south? There just seems to be a lack of anything like that, and I, I just don't like it. So those two maps just have no activity, like we've seen, everything goes up and around. All the activity is across here, because the distances are just too big across here, that's why. Oh, look, travel with the Monaco people, the Grimaldi lines, the Hamiltons. And look, they then go, no one goes across here. No one goes across here. Everybody's going up and down again. Look, all activity is like that. Same here, look. No one's going across this way. They're all going up and down this way, maybe. In every picture, really, except those few ones that, that said were commercial cargo, etc. But this is cargo class, you see. So why can't you, if there's boats that go across here, why can't I get cargo class across there, eh? Again, another fraudulent thing, you see. I reckon this is a really good one. Now, people that have sailed the world, they should be, you know, and especially in the next year or so, if somebody watches these videos like this, there's another few up on things like this. You think there'd be a bit of really good research done. 